Well, I mean, the, the, you know, the discussion that we just had about kind of um, the, you know, bringing forward a lot of women artists, and I think to me, what it seems to be happening is very interesting. Um, is it's, it's yes, it's it's partly about feminism, but it's also about I think a breakdown of the canon, so that it's not just you know, kind of undiscovered women artists, but we're, we're getting undiscovered male artists. I mean, I just was up in Boston and saw the Hyman Bloom show, which is an amazing show of an artist who was very little known and, and should be much better known. Um, you mentioned the show at the Guggenheim, and um, what's interesting, the, the show at the Guggenheim, Hyman Bloom. Hyman Bloom, oh my God. Yeah, no, it's amazing, just an amazing artist. Um, and, and the show at the, at the Guggenheim, which was, um, I think, six artists picking works from the collection. And again, it struck me that what it was really about, again, was canon breaking, that they were finding works in the collection by artists who really weren't well known and putting them in a, in a new context. So I just want to say that it, it's not just about finding new women artists, but I think there's really, I mean, the, the canon is, is sort of breaking apart, maybe being reshuffled or rediscovered, or maybe we're not having a canon anymore. But it, anyway, there's an interesting phenomenon going on there. So that was just a comment. Um, my, my question um, has to do with the, the issue of spirituality in your work. Um, because one of the things that, again, that strikes me, the, the work, it has a certain dialogue with minimalism, but one of the things that makes it very unlike kind of standard minimalist work, you know, is that it, it has this sort of, because of the sense of light, the sense of kind of the ineffable, you know, that, that it seems to me that there is a, a kind of spiritual aspect. And I'm curious about whether, you know, that's something that you feel is there or how you would respond to that. Um, yeah, I definitely feel that's there, and uh, I'm actually trying to create like God moments, like moments where you just go, oh, like uh, I think uh, beauty is transcendental, and I think I think that like let's say you're really, I mean it's a pretty simple example here. Let's say you're really bummed out and you're sad and something horrible's happened, and then you see some incredible natural phenomenon like a beam of light coming down or Jesus rays coming out, you know, you forget for a minute, you've transcended your pain for that moment. And just just simply like, just simply like that, uh, beauty, I believe strong, I'm a big fan of beauty. I think beauty is really important. I don't think beauty should be, uh, sh beauty. Beauty, beauty, yes. So I think I think actually art is about beauty. Now this may be very unfashionable, but that's what I think. 